Hello there, my name is Mark Jeffrey. I'm going to teach you the basics of how to use the Glossy Editor. So the first thing you'll want to do from the home page is click on Create Your Own Glossy. This will have the effect of bringing up the Glossy Editor, which is where you actually do your authoring. Um, and there's really just two things you need to know about this. On the left-hand side here, you'll see a number of thumbnails of pages in your Glossy. Um, if you haven't authored anything, we actually provide some uh, templates for you. Um, these are very random. I mean, you can use them or not. It's totally up to you. Um, but we just like to give you a little place to begin. And you'll notice if I click on any one of these, it changes what's uh, displayed here in the canvas area on the right. And the canvas area is where you actually do your authoring, where you actually edit the page. Um, I'm not going to get too much into that just, just yet. Um, up here on, on the upper uh, right-hand side of the left is a thing called clippings. Now, yours will probably not be filled with images. Clippings are the raw materials that you use to create a glossy. You will have uh, probably accumulated a number of images and other uh, assets over some period of time, um, and which you probably haven't yet, because I have, because I've been using it quite a bit, obviously. Um, so don't be surprised if this is blank for you. And you can basically drag and drop any one of these pictures into the canvas area, um, depending on what, you, what template you're using. As long as there's an image uh, area ready to receive it, you can just drag and drop images right on there all day. Um, so anyway, so now you know the basics of how the, uh, the authoring system works. Uh, one last thing, actually, if you would like to reorder the pages, you can simply drag and drop the page to where you would like it to be, and it will move and it will go there, and we'll just reorder the pages, and it'll take a few minutes. But uh, once it's done, uh, the reordering will have occurred, and it doesn't matter how many pages you have. Um, so that's it. Those are the basics of how to use the Glossy Editor.